after much soul searching and reflection, I've found just three letters that could possibly belong on that marquee. H, H, H. You've got to be kidding me. He's not serious. I'm alive, I can't complain no more. The sun, I baby, I don't see the rain no more. The watch You wanted to see me, Teddy? Absolutely, player. I've got some big news for you. Have a seat. No thanks. I'd rather stand. Suit yourself, dog. Now, I ain't gonna beat around the bush here. I'm just gonna come right out with it. You've just been traded to Raw. What? What do you mean I've been traded? Easy, easy. They really wanted you over there, player. You're exactly what they need to take Raw to the next level. And look. I'm not happy about losing a superstar of your caliber, but they made me an offer I just couldn't refuse. Believe that. They gave me everything except TV time on Monday nights to get your contract. Well, I guess it's not hard to see why. And that WWE title would look good around my waist. See? That's what I'm talking about. So thanks for everything you've done for SmackDown, player. And good luck to you on Monday Night Raw. Good luck to me? Hey, no hard feelings, but you're the one who just traded away the best superstar on your brand. Let me wish you luck. Because now that I'm a Raw superstar, SmackDown's going to need it. Later, Teddy. Champ, I just wanted to call and tell you that tonight, I'm going to give you just a small taste of exactly what I've got in store for you at Backlash. Now that I'm the number one contender, I guarantee that the WWE title is coming home with me. And there's not a damn thing you or anyone else can do about it. You think you know me. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of my broadcast partner, Jerry the King Lawler and myself, welcome to Monday Night Raw. And King, I have to ask, have you ever seen Edge as focused as he has been the past few weeks? Absolutely not, JR. I've never seen a superstar rise through the ranks as fast or as ruthlessly as Edge. And ever since Mr. McMahon personally named him the number one contender, he's been like a man possessed. Possessed by an insatiable desire to hold the WWE title, that is. And I think that tonight, Edge is going to show the WWE Champion exactly what he's got to look forward to at Backlash. And it won't be great. I have all the respect in the world for Edge's experience and in-ring ability. But if I had to choose a superstar to represent Raw as our WWE Champion, I've got to say that my choice would be this man right here. Well, enjoy it while it lasts, JR, because I have a funny feeling that that title's gonna be back around the waist of Edge come back last. I wouldn't bet my Oklahoma farm on that, King. Let's see how the two of them match up here tonight in this non-title match before we start making any predictions. Good evening and welcome to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, the site of tonight's live Raw event. And Pittsburgh has gone completely crazy for the superstars of Raw. And who can blame them? Not me, King. The Steel City's in for a treat tonight, and I can't wait to get 
get started. So, how do you think this one's going to turn out, JR? Honestly, King, I have absolutely no idea. Anything can happen here in the WWE. Well, you've got to have a guess, right? He's got the crowd and his opponent in the palm of his hand. That can change in an instant, especially if you let your opponent catch his breath. He countered that one perfectly. What a counter! He saw that one coming. The Undertaker's been in WWE for 13 years now, JR. And I think it's really starting to show here tonight. I don't know what match you're watching, King, but the dead man looks as good tonight as when he first appeared in the WWE. I'm not sure if it's your eyes or your brain that shot, JR, but that's ridiculous. The Undertaker should quit now while he can still retire with some dignity. understand how these fans can do Edge, JR. They got no respect for everything he's done for them. Oh, you're full of it, King. These fans don't give a damn about Edge, because they know that Edge doesn't give a damn about him either. How can you say that, JR? Edge is one of the most exciting and dynamic superstars on the Raw roster. And I hope you don't drive him to SmackDown with the way you slander him. You know, JR, everyone goes on and on about how great The Undertaker is. But I think he's overrated. Looks like someone's heading for the high rent district. <laughs> These superstars sure aren't going easy on each other here tonight. What you expect, King? This isn't ballet, you know. Oh, really, JR? Gosh, tell me more about your in ring experience. Well, I've got a pinfall victory over Triple H to my credit. How about you? I'm so happy that we have a superstar like Edge on the Raw roster. Someone who sets goals for himself and doesn't let anything stop him from reaching them. He's a great role model for young fans. Oh, he's a terrific role model, all right. Edge is a real humanitarian. A guy who would just as soon sell you out as look at you. What are you talking about, JR? That's just a nasty rumor spread by people who wanted to be in Edge's league, but couldn't keep up with him. Come on, King. You've watched Edge as much as I have. And you've seen the things he's pulled. Talk about someone whose heart is as cold as the other side of the hill. If there's the submission, there might not be any way out of it. There better be, or we're going to see a tap out right here. Sounds like this crowd's got something on their minds, King. Who cares about them, JR? Look what's going on in the ring. think you'd be watching these superstars compete against each other here tonight, JR? I had a feeling their paths were going to cross sooner or later, and I'm glad I'm here to see. Me too. It almost makes it worth having to sit next to you and listen to those corny expressions of yours. What the heck is a government mule anyway? It's what you get beat like. We're in the middle of a slobber knot. And if you don't have... It looks like he's taking his opponent for a ride, King. And that's one ride you don't ever want to take. The last ride... You gotta respect the commitment and the dedication of these superstars to their careers. No question about it, King. Every superstar on the roster has had to make more sacrifices than any other professional athlete I know. It really is like being married. He's got his opponent in a pinning predicament. Listen up. You are looking at the new general manager of Raw. I don't believe this. This has to be some kind of sick joke. Mr. McMahon named Triple H interim GM. That's right. I've decided to sacrifice my in-ring career for a little while in order to give Raw the leadership and direction it needs. 
Now I know that decision's going to disappoint a lot of you. But it's what's right for business, and I always do what's right for business. For example, although Edge has been named the number one contender for the WWE title, his match last week against the champion left me feeling a little... Nah. So suffice it to say, with all the talent in the back, I think Raw can do better than that. And Edge actually won't be going to Backlash to compete for the WWE title. Well, if Edge is out, who's the number one contender then? Over the next few weeks, I'm going to conduct an exhaustive search to find the most worthy contender. And that search starts tonight, when the champion faces five top Raw contenders in a non-title, over-the-top rope battle royal. the superstars he's chosen. Though I can't quite see what it is exactly. Come on now. This is just absurd. I know there isn't a bad superstar on the entire Raw roster, but these guys are obviously not quite ready for prime time. Well, bet these guys are glad you're not the general manager, JR. They're getting the opportunity of a lifetime, and you're raining all over their parade. Does it? Now I've seen everything. Triple H is obviously up to something here, but I'll be damned if I can figure out what it is. Calm down, JR. I'm sure Triple H has a plan. He wouldn't be our new general manager if he didn't know what he was doing. I'm sure Triple H knows exactly what he's doing. He isn't stupid, but I have no company idea what he's trying to do here. Star who truly deserves the opportunity to main event a pay-per-view. If I had to put money on anyone in this match, I'd have to put it on him. Yeah, but don't underestimate his opponent. Every one of those guys wants to be the one who eliminates the WWE Champion. That's true, King. And no matter who you are, five on one odds are five on one odds. Raw is live tonight from Santa Fe, New Mexico, where the spectacular crowd is on its feet. If we don't get this show on the road, I think we're going to have a riot on our hands, JR. You might be right, King. Good thing we've got extra security on hand here tonight. This crowd is ready for action. Well, he took a ride over the top rope, down to the floor, and out of this match. Shovel, JR. And there's the elimination. This has gone beyond just being a match, JR. I think these superstars genuinely hate each other. There's no love lost between these competitors, that's for sure. If looks could kill, he just got tossed out rather unceremoniously, in my opinion. You're not going to get him with that one. 
I think this crowd's giving the superstar a textbook reversal there. Boy, when you look at these superstars, it really drives home the fact that Raw is the dominant brand of sports entertainment. Well, there's no doubt about that, JR. There's not a superstar on the SmackDown roster who could hold a candle to Raw's finest. Yeah. I wouldn't go that far. Man. There are quite a few SmackDown superstars who I'd love to have on Raw. Oh, come on, JR. Why would you want to lower the tone of the Raw locker room by bringing in some losers from SmackDown? King, next time you call The Undertaker, Kurt Angle, and Chris Benoit losers, make sure you give me some warning so I can get the hell out of here before you do it. I don't want to be any part of what that's going to get you. It looks like they've slowed the match down a little, and I think that's some good strategy right there. It certainly is. I'm sure they're well acquainted with the old expression, fools rush in. Is that why you always seem to be in such a hurry, JR? I think I've eaten a little too much good Oklahoma barbecue in my day, King, to hurry anyway. Davari's one of those people who blames everyone else for his problems. And I can't stand that. You'd think that eventually he'd realize that if everyone gives him a hard time, Everywhere he goes, and maybe, just maybe, there's something about him that makes them act that way. I think you're giving Davari more credit than he deserves, JR. I think he'd rather complain about things rather than try to do anything about them. Listen to the crowd, JR. I think they are reversing. Can he capitalize on it? I've got to say, JR, I'm really impressed by what we've seen here tonight. How could you not be, King? These are some of the finest athletes in all of sports entertainment. I know that, JR. I'm just saying that this has been a great match so far. It has indeed, King. And I think it's only going to get better from here on out. No! No! How can the referee allow something like that? Come on, JR. You know that the referee's health plan doesn't include vision. Are you enjoying the match so far? Yes, I am. I think these superstars are putting on more than a hell of an exhibition here tonight. What's your favorite part of it so far? I don't think it's happened yet. My favorite part of the match will be when you quit camping and let me enjoy it. Now, now, JR. Keep your words soft and sweet because you may have to eat them later. JR, can you imagine SmackDown putting on a match half as good as this? No disrespect intended for our SmackDown colleagues, but no, I can't be. I truly believe Raw is a dominant brand of sports entertainment. And you hit the nail right on the head there, JR. The dominant brand. Not the slightly better brand or the sort of superior brand. Absolutely not. I'm a Raw man. And I have to believe we're head and shoulders better than the competition. You won't get any argument from me, JR. Slag down to the minor leagues as far as I'm concerned. You know, JR, talk about... Here's your winner. The Undertaker. Hey, this is your general manager, so listen up. I've been getting a lot of crap from Edge about how he deserves to be in the WWE title picture. So to shut him up, I'm teaming the two of you up against Carlito, Kane, and Kurt Angle tonight. I want to evaluate those guys as potential contenders 
and give Edge one more chance to prove that he deserves a title opportunity. Yeah, it's a three-on-two match, but you're the WWE Champion, so suck it up. You think you know me? I admit I've never been Edge's greatest fan, but the fact is that he earned a WWE title opportunity, an opportunity that Triple H whipped him of as soon as he became the interim general manager on Raw. Look, JR, I'm an Edge head, and I know that Mr. McMahon named Edge the number one contender, but if our general manager Triple H says that the rated R superstar isn't ready, then he's obviously not ready. From Death Valley, weighing in at 305 pounds, The Undertaker. I spit in the face of people who don't want to be cool. And the opponent. From Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 230 pounds. Weighing 326 pounds, Kane! Ladies and gentlemen, Raw is live tonight from St. Paul, Minnesota. I'm Jim Rose here with Terry the King Law. These Minnesota fans have been waiting a long time to see the Raw superstars in action, and I know they're not going to be disappointed. They certainly won't, King. The Twin Cities are never going to forget the day Raw came to town. A reversal. We could be looking at a pitfall here, folks. Boy, when you look at these superstars, it really drives home the fact. Would you look at that? A frankly illegal maneuver. That should be a disqualification. You might be right, JR, but I don't hear the ring bell. This match is still going. Look at this, JR. Oh, man. Oh, I've been in this hole before, JR. This brings back some bad memories. I can understand why, King. I can't even imagine the pain being inflicted here. He's not going to get caught with that one. There's the reversal. I don't even know if you can use the word monster to describe Kane anymore. He's become so twisted and so evil that it almost sounds like a compliment. Kane's never going to be up for the Humanitarian of the Year award, JR. But I think that's exactly what makes him such a great superstar. There's the tag. That's the way to do it. I'm so happy that we have a superstar like Edge on the Raw roster. Someone who sets goals for himself and doesn't let anything stop him from reaching them. He's a great role model for young fans. Oh, he's a terrific role model, all right. Edge is a real humanitarian. And now he's bringing in his partner. Excellent counter. What ring presence. It's like he read his opponent's mind. This has gone beyond just being a match, JR. I think these superstars genuinely hate each other. There's no love lost between these competitors, that's for sure. If looks could kill, somebody would be pushing up daisies right now. And you've got to admit, that makes for a much more interesting match, Jay. And now pin! This could be it! Oh, this match has the potential to be an instant classic. And I think these fans are too stupid to realize it. How can you say that, King? How can you insult the intelligence of these WWE fans? Well, I heard that we gave them an IQ test. These fans can't stand it when he does this, JR. But I think it's great. He's sure not going to win over any fans of that. Looks like the tag is made. That was a smart tag, JR. <laughs> why you like Carlito so much, JR. What, did he lie to you and tell you that you were cool or something? 
I've never been accused of being cool by Carlito or anyone else. Dude. Quite frankly, I'm not sure I'd know cool if it bit me on my Oklahoma Sooner backside. Everyone says that Kurt Angle is one of the greatest superstars in the business, but considering he went from Raw to SmackDown to ECW, that's like claiming the tag is made. He's a slippery devil. So, how do you think this one's gonna turn out, JR? Honestly, King, I have absolutely no idea. Anything can happen here in the WWE, but you've got to have a guess, right? I might, but I'd rather keep it to myself if it's all the same to you, King. Is there any superstar in WWE who can go toe to toe with that man, The Undertaker? I don't think there is. Have you got both your contacts in one eye, JR? There's no way The Undertaker's gonna win this match. Oh, for the love of... Open your eyes, Fred! I can't believe he got away with that. Well, you might not like it, JR, but he's gonna do whatever it takes to win this one. The referee saw the tag. I've been looking forward to this match all night, JR. He's a three count away from a pinfall. Sounds like this crowd's got something on their minds, King. Who cares about them, JR? Look what's going on in the ring. You gotta respect the commitment and the dedication of these superstars to their careers. No question about it, King. Every superstar on the roster has had to make more sacrifices than any other professional athlete I know. The submission is locked in. This could be here. Oh, oh my gosh, JR. You can't go along without tapping after this. The very sight of Kane makes my blood run cold. What an inhuman monster he is. You say monster like it's a bad thing, JR. But everyone loves a monster, whether they want to admit it or not. Dracula, Frankenstein, and the Wolfman never go out of style. Well, there's a big difference between seeing a monster in a movie and knowing that a real-life monster like Kane is walking the earth, King. Listen to the crowd, JR. I think they've got something to say to these superstars. And if they're smart, they'll listen. Remember, without these fans, these superstars are out of a job. going to be a terrific matchup. Oh, come on, JR. You're just talking through your hat. He's fat. That's a short climb, but a potentially long climb. Good Lord. Hit first right into that security barrier. And that is not something you want to get hit with. And flat on your back with your shoulders on the mat is no place to be. I think it's pretty obvious which way this one's going to go, JR. Well, from my perspective, this is still anybody's match. I'd like to see things from your perspective, JR. But I'd have to get my head out of my... He's going up, JR! This could be big! I've had many opportunities to see Carlito up close and in person. And I have to tell you, 
I'm impressed with what this kid brings to the table. What's that exactly? A bunch of half-chewed apples? What's so cool about that? i tell you what's cool, King, and that's the charisma and athletic ability of this second-generation superstar. Sorry, JR, but I just don't see it. Maybe they'll get it right with the third generation. Look at that! He's busted wide open! This is great! I don't know what's so great about watching a human being brutalized like this. Come on, JR! You know this isn't ballet. His opponent telegraphed that one. The referee is out, King! Will we see someone take advantage? I'd be disappointed in them if they didn't, JR. This is a great opportunity! I think this crowd's giving these superstars a piece of their minds, King. Are you sure they can afford it, Jake? Whoops! There goes the referee! Oh, man! And now there's no one to keep order in this matchup! These superstars sure aren't going easy on each other here tonight. What do you expect, King? This isn't ballet, you know. Oh, really, JR? Gosh, tell me more about your in-ring experience. Well... I've got a pinfall victory over Triple H to my credit. How about you? What? Boy, it's obvious these superstars have done their homework on each other. They sure have. This is one hell of an insane. He's got his opponent up. And what goes up must come down. In this case, on that very thinly padded security barricade. And it's been reversed. Five. Well, you can't ever accuse the WWE fans of being shy about it. Did you see that? Bring the damn bell! You can't let somebody get away with that! I don't think the ref saw it, JR! And if the ref doesn't see it, it's not illegal! I know that Kurt Angle has served the fans and fellow superstars the wrong... You think you know me. I'm sure you really impressed all these people out here tonight. But when you're in a position like mine, part of the job description is to be decisive and make tough decisions. Although I appreciate you busting your ass out here tonight, I also have to live up to my responsibilities as interim GM. And that means I can't just flip-flop on a decision I made a few short weeks ago. So I'm afraid you're still not number one contender material and you're not gonna get a title shot at back. Oh, what a load of... What the hell does the game have against Edge? Oh my gosh! Edge has lost it! King, I think Edge could beat our interim general manager a knuckle sandwich right about now and have no regrets at all. And who could blame him?
Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, I've just been informed that Edge has been suspended indefinitely for physically threatening the interim GM of Raw, Triple H. We just saw it right there, JR. Edge chased Triple H right up the ramp. And who knows what happened backstage? Obviously, he tried to give Triple H a piece of his mind. And I don't think that there's any way that you can claim that Triple H didn't try to provoke that very reaction in Edge. It's no secret that the R-rated superstar has a short fuse, and the game lit a hell of a fire directly under it. I don't know what Triple H has against Edge, but it's a sickening abuse of power in my view. From Ladies and gentlemen, Raw has come home for one of the biggest events of the year, live in the heart of New York City. They don't come any bigger than the Big Apple, JR, and they don't get any better than the superstars of Raw. They sure don't, King. New Yorkers don't impress easily, but there's no doubt in my mind that the Raw superstars are more than up for the task. Is there any superstar in WWE who can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with that man, The Undertaker? I don't think there is. Have you got both your contacts in one eye, JR? There's no way The Undertaker's gonna win this match. Just look at him. Oh, I am, King. I'm looking at one of the most awesome forces I've ever seen in a WWE ring. And I think the dead man's gonna remind everyone tonight why they call him the Phenom. So, JR, are you enjoying the match so far? Yes, I am. I think these superstars are putting on one hell of an exhibition here tonight. What's your favorite part of it so far? I don't think it's happening yet. My favorite part of the match would be when you quit yapping and let me enjoy it. Now, now, JR, keep your words soft and sweet because you may have to eat them later. Sounds like this crowd's got something on their minds, King. Who cares about them, JR? Excellent count. What? He went straight for the pin. No flies on him. He turned the tables on his opponent with that one. You've got to love Ric Flair. The Nature Boy doesn't let anything stand in his way. Yeah, including the roof. I think if there wasn't a WWE superstar, he'd make a great lawyer or politician. What's going to turn out, JR? Honestly, King, I have absolutely no idea. Anything can happen here in the WWE. But you've got to have a guess, right? I might, but I'd rather keep it to myself if it's all the same to you, King. This match has the potential to be an instant classic. And I think these fans are too stupid to realize it. How can you say that, King? How can you insult the intelligence of these WWE fans? Well, I heard that we gave them an IQ test, and the results came back negative. Folks, I've got to apologize for the King here tonight. He must have gotten up on the wrong side of somebody else's bed this morning. I think these superstars are getting some feedback from the crowd, JR. Nothing wrong with that, King. That's what we like to hear. I think it's pretty obvious which way this one's gonna go, JR. Well, from my perspective, all's fair in love and war, JR. And I love it when this guy goes to war. Whoever said that cheaters never prosper certainly never saw this man in action. He's a slippery devil. These superstars are putting on a great match so far, JR. But if they drop the ball, these fans will let them hear about it. I don't think that's gonna happen, King. These competitors know that their paychecks come straight from the WWE fans. They're not going to let them down. Yeah, but if they don't keep the fans happy... If, if. 
If wishes were fishes, the world would be an ocean. But that's not the case now, is it? You know, JR, everyone goes on and on about how great. It looks like he's taking his opponent for a ride, King. And that's one ride you don't ever want to take. The last ride. Looks like he's trying for a pin here. Here's your winner, The Undertaker. Here we go. Triple H is gonna reveal the number one contender for the WWE title. Well, he took That's a sweet turn about it. Backlash is this Sunday. As you've all witnessed, I've spent the last few weeks conducting an exhaustive search for the number one contender for the WWE title at Backlash. In that time, I've examined the entire Raw roster from top to bottom, backwards and forwards, over and over. Oh, get to the point already, Shh. would you? Shh. The general manager's talking. And after much soul searching and reflection, I found just three letters that could possibly belong on that marquee. H, H, H. You've got to be kidding me. He's not serious. So for the sake of Raw, I'm gonna pull double duty this Sunday and serve as both general manager and the number one contender for the WWE title. This is absolutely disgusting. Big Raw's general manager wants it enough. Triple H needs a WWE. 